Hi, this is Spice, your Charlotte Urban Gardener. Today I'm in my grow room and I'm going to plant ginger. So I'm going to use this container because ginger doesn't have to be planted deep. Uh, it can be planted in a shallow container. So I've already put some holes in the bottom of this container. I'm going to let it drain into this leftover container. Those are good for when you have after, you know. <laughs> but anyway, I'm going to add some loose soil. So I've already mixed the soil. And I'm going to add that. And I uh, put the ginger in water in a plastic bag. So um, I was supposed to do it for like 24 hours. And of course, um, life happened. So it was in there uh, 48 hours. So, and look at that. Look, see? Sprouts already. See that? And this is out of the grocery store ginger. I didn't order it or anything. I just got it out of my out of my local supermarket. So, you, I'm going to plant this ginger and I'm going to try I'm going to attempt to grow my ginger indoors. But what is ginger good for? Ginger is good for uh bloating and gas. It's also good for it's a great antioxidant as well. So, we're going to grow our ginger. So I'm just going to plant this ginger. It doesn't have to be deep. I'm just going to lay it in there. Maybe I should put it on this side so you can see it. Just going to lay it in there. And here's my other piece of ginger that I put in the plastic bag. Now I could cut this into smaller pieces, but from what I've learned is that I want to leave it in a larger piece. So I'm just going to plant it just like that. And then I'm going to cover it up, cover it up. And then I'm going to wait for my ginger to start growing. Now we have our ginger planted and under the grow light. And remember when I planted those carrots, I was experimenting indoors with carrots. Yeah, I just knocked, I believe, one of my lights out. So, there are my carrots. My ginger's just planted today, and I expect to see a harvest. <laughs> 